Hello and welcome to Art305 Online. I just wanted to say hello to you. My name is Jennifer Klein. I also wanted to go through your syllabus and explain the whole online thing. We will never all be online at the same time. There's no prescribed time that you have to be there and I will appear at some point. You manage all of your own time. So the week starts on Monday at 12.01 a.m. and it goes all the way to Sunday at 11.59 p.m. So do all of the things in that week's box in that week and you're golden. So just manage your time, do your quiz in that week, read the material. For every 10 point quiz, which you have 15 minutes to take, you will have um, a little file that says 10 things to look for or things to look for. That way you don't have to try and synthesize all of that information and memorize it. You can just focus on those um, things that will be on the quiz. If I have one piece of advice for you, it would be do not miss quizzes. This course is totally points based and when you miss quizzes in the beginning, it makes the taking the midterm and the final a do or die nail biting experience and you don't need that kind of stress. So let's just float along and remember to do your quizzes and you're going to do just fine. Let's look at your syllabus, which is at the top of your online page. So we click on it. And here we have the name of the class and Dave Bowman from Stanley Kubrick's movie 2001, but this was recently redone for a Mondo poster and I thought it was particularly beautiful. So because this is art and mass culture, which is art history and television and movies and advertising and all of that, I thought this was perfect and so cool. And also because it's an online class, you know, computers being creepy. So my office hours and the fact that this is an online class your student learning objectives. And finally, I use the total points method. So always check the points that you have earned to back to this syllabus grading point scale. Uh, do not look at Canvas only because it will only show you the points that you have attempted, the points that you have attempted to take, and you might get a wildly different um, uh, score that you think you're getting always go back to the syllabus and look at these points and you can see where you are. There's a weekly quiz, um, preface to chapter 13, two discussion questions which will come up along the way, a midterm and a final. It's very simple, keep up with everything and you're going to do great. Finally is your class schedule here which is when everything is due, but basically due on Sunday, so do everything by Sunday. There's a spring break, and also your final exam date and additional reading. So if you are so inclined um, and you're loving art history, here are some uh, articles and books I have found which are very reader-friendly. Uh, they don't kind of keep that hand up uh, of being so academic that they're impossible to read. These are really important um, articles that are edifying and fun to read. So here's a whole list. So again, welcome, and I hope that we have a lovely semester together, which I'm sure we will, and um, I'll be communicating with you the entire time. So have a good semester. Thanks.